Well, it is empty in here today as I start my day, and the very first thing that I grabbed was a pair of Ariat sandals. So I just, just walked in, and I do see some stuff that's catching my attention. Oh, these are really pretty. El Naturalis, oh, those are gorgeous. You know what, I'm grabbing those. I've never heard of this brand, but I love the way that looks. So I'm gonna take those. And then I did see a pair of New Balance, and if these are in good shape, let me see what size these are. Oh, they're they're actually an eight. I was surprised. I didn't think they were that big. Um, they're they're clean and they're a nice color. I will check to see if um, if um, these have any resale value on them though. But for right now, I'm gonna put them in the cart. So that's good. I'm off to a real quick start this morning. Um, I do, I did see the bean boots, but as you can tell, the insides are totally um, gone on those. So I will, um, I will leave those. And I do see these all birds right here. These are a gray. Um, I, I think the material is coming apart right there. So I'm going to put those back. So I'm just grabbing and seeing what I'm seeing. They, def they definitely have restocked though. I'm seeing a bunch of stuff. So I need to make sure, these are BCBG. Um, I need to make sure I'm checking, checking the tags and um, these are another pair of those Clark Bendables. These are actually really, um, really nice shoes. Um, I do like it. I'm, I'm concerned that the leather has actually, yeah, the, the leather is actually coming off on the toe. So I'm not going to take them if the leather's coming off on the toe. So we'll come back here. Maybe we'll get lucky and see a cart. It's pretty early. Like I said, this place is empty right now. So I'm kind of in enjoying myself. That means I can talk to you guys. Um, there might have to be a voiceover. Um, Carl will let me know later on um, if that ha has to happen. Um, they've been turning the music up, um, especially, especially in the mornings, it seems like, or maybe it's just because it's, it's not as busy. It's just feels louder. So we do have to, we do have to remedy that. Okay, so I'm gonna come along the, the black shoes. I am looking at um, the boots on the top. Looks like some heels. Um, you know, if I, see, if I see a pair of heels I like, I will get them. Um, those are some Atrex, but uh, not my, not, not something I think I wanna take. So I am still looking. Oh, those are cute. Little some slippers up here too. You know, I do buy slippers, especially when they're UGG or things like that, because they, they just they sell. They don't sell for a lot, but they sell, and that's that's all you can hope for. These are. I don't think these are UGGs. No, these are something else. Well, we'll know. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe they are UGGs. Are these the ones that were ripped? Well, let's check. No, those are a Kohl's brand. Okay, so those were a, a good, a good knockoff, but definitely, definitely not the original. Oh, and I can hear carts running around out there too. I can hear her, hear her. I don't know where she's going, but I hear the cart. Mm. Looking at all the little shoes. Ooh, those don't feel very good. Yeah, as soon as I picked those up, those didn't feel very good. Okay. Some of these things I saw a few days back and they're still here. So they're gonna, they're just gonna have to stay cause I'm not gonna, those are cute. Those Vince commuters are cute, but the heel is um, really worn on that. So we'll go ahead and leave that one right there. These are, oh, still, I think I picked those up before. Those are Paramosimos. I'm gonna leave those too. We'll go around to the end caps and see what we see. Okay. I'm gonna check the end caps too. Oh, these are nice. What are these? Those are, oh, those are Skechers. I wonder what size those are. 
thought oh, those are a nine. Those are, those are, they're cute. Um, I, I don't really buy a ton of Skechers. Those are, those are, they're nice, but I think, are they in, are they in, I think they're, they're probably a mints. Yeah, they're probably a mints. I think I'm going to leave those for right now. That's something to think about, but I don't think I, I don't think I want to do that. Here's a pair of purple Merrells. Oh, look at those. Those are brand new. These are just like the ones I bought the other day. You know what? Purple may not be everyone's favorite color, but um, honestly, these these are brand new. So they just, well, no, maybe they're not new. They've got a little bit of hair on them, but I'll, I mean, I'll, I'll take some tape to them and get the hair off, but they're very cute. So I will check to see on those. I'm not opposed to it is what I'm saying. Those are some, some targets up there. I can see the thicker zipper on this one. What is this one? Those are a size 10. No, I think those are just something generic because there's nothing nothing inside of that. Got some Donna Karen and... I see these on the bottom, but I don't know what they are. Okay, I looked at those before, so I'm not gonna get those. So... Let's see what these are. Trigo Oh, these are Zara's. Um, they're cute. I don't know. Um, I don't know if I want to get those though. They didn't mark them up, but I guess I am being really picky right now. Oh, here's a pair of Riker shoes. Okay, now this time when I buy Riker shoes, I have to tell you, I will own it. The last time I bought a pair of Riker shoes, they were two different sizes when I got home. So, but I suspect somebody bought them that way. So I am going to check this. Okay, that's a 41. So, and this is a 41. Okay, I'm gonna take this because I actually checked the sizes and made sure that they are, <laughs> they're, they're a matching set. Yeah, go figure. But yes, people people really do that. They they buy two different size shoes and and um, Goodwill doesn't catch it and I didn't catch it. I mean, because they looked, you know, it was a matching pair. So just to let you know, when you're out and about, you probably need to actually check to make sure that the shoes are the same size. I doubt I'll do that again. Oh, these are cute. Look at these Allegrias. Oh, those are so cute. That's very, they're very cute. I think I'll, I'll put those in the cart. I do have a coupon on my little stampers. So they, it's, it's full. So that means um, I will get 20% off of everything I purchased today. So even if I grab something that's a little bit more expensive, I'm okay with that because, you know, the discount kicks in and that's, that makes a difference. Oh, see, I would have taken those, but the insides look horrible on those. And what about these? What are these? Nope, I'm not thinking those are great. I've seen a lot of um, very generic looking shoes that look, are like knockoffs of other things. I'm kind of wondering where people are finding all these, these knockoffs, you know? Yeah, see, like that's not Vans. Those are, those are knockoffs, so. I guess we're gonna have to start looking at the the shoes real closely to make sure that um, to make sure that they're not you know they're not fakes. Those are some bass. What about these? French Shriner. Those are gorgeous. I have been buying a lot more men's shoes lately just because I've been finding some really nice quality brands and. Men, men don't wear wear their shoes out in them for the most part as much as as women do. So they, they just they turn them in and there's a pair of Stacy Adams. So, oh, well those look new. Some Stacy Adams can do really well. I do not believe these have ever been worn outside. So I might put those in my cart just because um, I don't think they've ever been worn out, and they are they are not marked up. Okay, so some Stacy Adams are good. 
not all. So I will have to look them up each. Here's, in fact, there's more of them up here on the top shelf. Yep, there's another pair. Yeah, so like these plain ones, I probably won't take. These are nice, these Calvin Klein driving shoes, but they're they're starting to wear in the fronts. Um, these are these are nicer too. Those are actually Clarks. Well, I don't think I found anything I had to have. I'm gonna check around here too and see if they put anything on this front shelf because I don't think I stopped to look at this one. Nope, I did not. Okay. Well, let's go in the back since it's so nice and quiet in here and look at wallets and purses. Um, a lot of the pieces, the purses that I left behind um, a few days back that were in the front shelf, they had some really nice ones, but they had just gotten ridiculously expensive. I mean, at least for me, ridiculously expensive. Um, here's a brand new Scala um, beanie hat. This looks like it was somebody's Christmas present. Oh, this has got it for the ponytail in it. You know what? I'm going to toss that in. That might be something, um, that might be something I just keep for myself. Um, I have a lot of hair, so it's, it's nice to be able to have, have my ears covered. Oh, that's pretty. What is this? I don't know what this is, but I like it. I'm gonna take this and take a look at that um, purse. And these are really cute too. I think I'm gonna take those also. All right, so we'll put those in the cart. Well, so far it's been a shoe day. I don't know what brand this is. Oh, somebody, put, you know what? Now that I'm holding it, I don't think I like it as much. Yeah, I think I'm gonna put that back. It, it feels waxy to me, and I don't know if it was like left in a storage box or, or where it was left, so. Oh, that's pretty. Look at this little coach bag. Well, depending. I usually shy away from the ones that have this much fabric on them, just because they don't always clean up very well. So depending on how the inside of this one looks, um, I'll know in a minute if I want it. Ooh, nope, and I do not. That is horrible on the inside. Okay, well that saved me some time. You know, it's easy to buy. Ooh, what is that? That's quite cute. Let me see, what is this? Oh, it's a Talbot's. You know what though? I really, I really do kind of like it. Um, oh, wait a minute. What's the inside? Okay, so the inside is doing something. It's flaking away. Darn it. I was kind of gonna, I was gonna be okay with getting this, but I, I'm not. Yeah, the inside, you can see it's different colored. Okay, so it's, it's flaking away on the inside. Well, that was a bummer. I kind of like that one. You can see some interesting things down here. What is this one? Okay, well that one they took, there's no label on it. Um, Christian Soriano. I knew this was a coach, I saw it before, but the inside was, was very dirty. This is an ATN Agner. Um, I'm pretty sure, but I, I just, I don't want to have to, all that, um, all that patent leather is just gonna cause me problems, so I think I'm gonna leave that. Now, what about this one? This little green backpack. It's kind of like a coach knockoff. Yeah, and kind of feels like, feels like a coach knockoff, so I'm gonna leave that one there. Maybe I'll get lucky and the girls will bring out some new racks while I'm here. Here's a little fossil canvas bag. It's really cute. It can be a cro it could be a crossbody or a shoulder bag, but I don't think um, the when it's like that, it's going to have um, much much value by the time you you pay the shipping for it. What is this one here? 
This is plum. Okay. There's something on the floor down here too. I need to, okay, I looked at that. That was the bueno before. So we put that one up so somebody can see it at least. This is laundry. I would say I didn't find anything over over here today. Yep, some of these have been here a while. So let me check the belts too, see if I see anything in the belts. Oops. Yeah, first belt I grabbed. I dropped one. I told you it's 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 pretty bad. I'm I'm pretty bad with the belts. I, I love I love to look at the belts, but as soon as I pick them up, they fall. What is this? That looks like an extender belt for that. Yeah, and if you didn't know that, you can buy, um, belts can be made with um, extender pieces to make them longer. Um, so yeah, I have seen those um, a few times. Oh, this is cute. The little tie has basset hounds on it. That's cute. Little, little basset hounds. Okay. Well, I think I'm gonna move towards I'm gonna move towards the back and see if I I find anything back there. Cause I've already gone through the shoes and I grabbed a few things. Oh I wanna put this I wanna put this back. I don't wanna take this, but I'll put it back where it needs to go. That way somebody else can see it. There, right up in front. Alright. I don't think I'm gonna see anything else over here. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and, and move on. All right, kind of looked through all that already. So I just wanna double check the end caps because you know, like I said, sometimes I, I walk by and I, I forget to check these. No, I think I'm good. All right, well, I think we'll head towards the back. So I will catch up with you in a minute. Hi everyone. I just want to do a quick recap of everything I got at the Goodwill today. It wasn't a huge haul, but I got some kind of interesting pieces. Um, I did, this is a, um, oh my God, a smooshy. I don't, I wasn't sure. I think it's, it's, it's they're not squishmallows. They're smooshies. I believe that's what they're called. And the, I just thought the cherries were really cute and they're, they're quite big. So, uh, I did grab those. I did get a pair of the Rikers and, and yes, thankfully they are uh, a matching set. Same same size shoes. Um, I did buy this Scala. Um, this is a girl's. This is one of the hats you can put your ponytail through. Um, I did grab that. It was brand new with tags. I also got a pair of Ariat sandals. Um, I did get a pair of Stacey Adams. These are brand new um, men's shoes. Uh, I don't buy a lot of Stacey Adams and I always have to look them up just to make sure um, because some are good and some are not. I did get a pair of these purple Merrells. I actually have a, a tan pair that are exactly the same in my shop right now and these are in really good condition. Um, I did get a pair of Bach clogs. I did get the Allegria. Um, these are the pink, I believe these are the breast cancer um, shoes. Uh, they're just, they're really, they're in really nice shape. You can see the, they've got the little logo on the side. Um, very unique. Um, I paid $10 for them. Um, I, I don't know if they have a huge amount of value, but, um, they were in really great shape. So I did grab those and I got a pair of these El Natural Alistas. I like I love the, the soles on these, kind of like a, a worn-in type of thing. Um, so I did grab those, um, you know, thinking that they're just a really nice looking shoe and um, I, I liked them, so I bought those too. Uh, my total spent at the Goodwill today was um, $72. Um, and I do think there's a couple of items here that will have some, some pretty good value on them. So um, total spent today was $72. And as usual, I really do appreciate everyone watching, viewing, commenting. Um, I love to see your questions. Um, and, and as usual, you know, thank you so much for watching. We really do appreciate it. And like and subscribe if you haven't already. I'll see you soon. Bye.